rest only in a healthy body. Life without health is a misery, a virtual death. These phrases, healthy, uh, means to be complete, a sense of wholeness within ourselves. For uh, this to happen, our body should be vibrant, our mind should be joyful, our emotions should be exuberant, our physical energy should be vibrant, and only then we can feel a sense of wholeness. Our basic system of education also explains how Anamaya Kosh, the physical body, contributes to the first level in the, uh, in the attainment of bliss, that is the ultimate aim of life. Any system of education, first of all, should focus on the physical aspects and should uh, care about the self. And for that, it can take proper diet, exercise, sports and yoga. A serious challenge that we are facing today that we are losing connection with nature. We need to have connection with nature and we should also teach our students to have connection with the nature. Our physiological and psychological health can be easily maintained if we are in touch with the elements of nature like soil, water and light. Activities like team sports should also be encouraged for social interaction as it helps to improve our mood and it fosters a sense of self-worth and improves our self-esteem and provides a clarity of thought. NP 2020 also talks about sports integrated education to foster holistic development among individuals. Such pedagogical strategies helps us to develop social skills like collaboration, cooperation, responsibility and citizenship. Finally, I would like to conclude with the thought of a great philosopher, Swami Vivekananda. My countrymen should have nerves of steel, muscles of iron, 